I'm currently going to school for my GED, taking night classes and working, and also doing a college career and readiness program. Basically, I was homeless in California for the longest of times, and I couldn't find any work to get any like living situation. So my dad told me I could move up here with him and, and try to find better off, you know, finish my GED, get all that good stuff done. I like that I have worked on math skills here to help me with some of my math classes. They use the Pythagorean theorem to turn square things round. I think that is very interesting, taking the square piece of wood and turning it round by using math. The lowest scores that we're seeing around basic skills are not in the reading and writing, but rather in the math area. Because they have different learning styles, kinesthetic or um, more visual learning styles, more interactive. Work Systems funded the build of uh, one vessel to really uh, create an opportunity for young people to apply math learning and to increase their math skills through contextualized learning in, in the process of building a boat. I've learned to not really doubt myself so much that I, I can, you know, use my brain to solve different problems and get things done. The transformation that happened for these young people around their confidence and their soft skills around suiting up, showing up, teamwork, communication were phenomenal. Oh, hands-on experience. That's what I love about this. I, I would much prefer this over a classroom any day. Oh, problem solving. <laughs> that is one big thing that I've learned with boat building is there's a lot of problems. No matter what you do, you're always going to run into a problem every day. I've also learned how to break out of my shell and step up and kind of take lead or charge if I need to. I accomplished something here that when I first came, I'd just seen a bunch of pieces of wood all numbered and named and we turned nothing into something. Once you do something and you stick through with it till the end, there's, you have no limits really. After this, you know, I would, uh, I would start making longboards and such, start making skateboards, go back to ADX, join there as a member and start making boards. I got a job now working with college and I'm really, really digging it. This boat thing really helped with the job reference. I finished my GED recently. Then I'm going to be jumping into the college itself for a welding certificate. Uh, Norm actually got me talking to Gary, which is the guy who runs Silver Eagle Welding and Manufacturing of Metal. And after I get my welding certificate, I'm going to be working there. I probably would be in a worse spot than I am today. I was down, I didn't have anything going on, and this has just kicked it into gear for me. I got an opportunity to go to PSU, you know, I got an opportunity to be have a mentor that's an engineer, you know, and it's just all the pieces are falling together and I just need to work harder and that's what I've been doing, pushing myself to do it. Because that's the only thing that's going to get me to where I want to be. And if I can overcome this at the age I am now, I'm sure I'll be fine. <laughs>